something we did that's very similar to what we did last year. We're going to be frying a bunch of shit. A lot of stuff. And or things. And the main attraction that we're going to be frying is... Dun, 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 dun. Legendary Donuts! Legendary Donuts! It's a small donut chain out here by us. Uh, and they have some pretty legendary donuts. We'll also be frying up a few other little things. So come along and join us as we fry shit to bring in the new year. Oh, and also, this episode is unofficially brought to you by... Not at all, actually. I found this in the store. Those of you who are into uh, Silicon Valley will appreciate this. I found Tres Comas. You know that means in Spanish? It means three commas. Three commas. So, stick around. All right. We got this thing. I forget the name of it, but... Uh, I'm calling it the Sasquatch. Yeah, apparently it's got peanut butter and shit in it, and it's a little too big to uh, fit in the fryer, so we're just going to have it. Oh, baby. Look at that. Look at that cross section. Look at that. Let's get her in the... Let's get her in the batter. In the batter? Ugh. Oh my god. Yeah, it's very buoyant. <laughs> I stop. And I start again. Need some concrete shoes for this guy. It's a very buoyant chunk of pastry. Stay down, you bastard. Oh boy. Oh dear. That's gonna soak that it. That breached. We got a breach! Alright, I think she's done all she's gonna do. Oh boy. She can't do any more, Captain! Uh, and we're deep frying next, my man. They call this the Oprah Winfrey. It's a maple bar with bacon. I'm not sure where the uh, the name comes from, what the correlation is between the two, but uh... It smells so mapley, by the way. Yes, it does. Burp. I'm gonna leave, leave some bacon behind. Oh, I put it maple glaze side down. We'll see how that smells. <laughs> like a mess. You can smell that maple smell in here. <laughs> <laughs> is it sexy? It smells good. It smells pretty damn it's delicious. good. Delicious. Does it need more bacon? I don't know. I just smell the maple from the maple glaze. That smells. That's a very mapley maple glaze. No. Oh. oh dear. It's a bubbling. Oh. It's a burbling. Oh dear, dear, dear. Look at T Buzz and his epic beard. I mean, from the side, you can really see just how it flows. <laughs> oh boy. I, I don't see much of that maple glaze still on the donut. Uh-oh. <laughs> I, think Ruff, it's, I think it's become one with the oil. Uh-oh. That'll happen. Oh, my. Here we see the rare tea buzz in his natural habitat. The kitchen? Frying things that he knows he shouldn't. Why? Because it is New Year's. That's right. we got to keep this train rolling. we got to keep this train rolling. We don't want to start no grease fire here. But we are prepared in case there is one. That's right. We're not going to... If we have to go all Tim and Tool Man Taylor, we are set. <laughs> Happy fucking New Year! I'm gonna say that this one's about as good as it's gonna get. Oh dear. What the hell happened to that thing? I don't know. It's fucking like uh I'm just a minge. It's got uh it's got the fucking two face thing going on it, here. Yeah, it kinda does. Eek. Rachel! Next we have a I've already brownie! Uh yeah, it's a chocolate uh brownie with uh yeah, M&M's on it. Uh, chocolate has got a very bad reputation with uh, frying, so we're going to see how much of a mess this is going to be. Ready. Burp. I'm learning how Boy. to film as I go, folks, so... 
I'm doing my best. Oh boy. All right. Cross your fingers. Wow, that maple smell just leapt out of there. <laughs> but there's no the maples over here. All right. That looks good. All right. So we have the uh, the random bear claw thingy. We're going to cut in the head. Let's see what it sounds like. Oh, boy. Wow. Better, worse? Um, oilier. Oh, my God. Oh, oh shit. Mm. He likes it. I think he likes it. Uh-oh. Two thumbs up? Not one, two? Ooh. I like the fruits. Mm hmm. section here except for you can see all the delicious mapley goodness in the bacon up there let's see what we got that's a lot of oil mm. oh damn was that good mm -hmm. the bacon flavor really pops does it mm -hmm. that little bit of bacon there wasn't a lot yeah. of bacon on that yeah that bacon sugar really comes out. Nice. And it's quite tasty. Um, yeah, it's good stuff. Cool. Uh, back to the Oprah. Not sure. Okay, I'm going to guess, yeah, that's the maple side. Let's do that. Oh, that is oily. Travis, um, Travis is right on the money. That, uh, that maple really pops quite nicely. That's very good. Maple the bacon. The maple, uh, the bacon! Excuse me. Bacon pops quite nicely. <laughs> I lied! I said maple. I meant bacon. Sue me. No, kidding. Please don't. I will, uh, totally like this, though. Mmm! 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 Then we have the good old... Brownie. Ooh. Hey, a lot of the chocolate actually stayed. Yeah. That looks very fudgy. Uh, it looks a little oily. Mm. It's nice because it's like a hot brownie again. I'm not sure if the brownie was that good to begin with. Mm, okay. Now. Yeah. Eh, it's okay. Okay. I brought an anise in that. Anus? Anise, yeah. There's a lot of anise in that. Like, uh, like they use anise seed to make it make it more chocolatey or whatever. Like those old school brownies. Yeah. That's totally what that made me think of. Yeah, there's just a the aftertaste is kind of like meh. Yeah. Well, yeah, because it makes you think of licorice. Yeah. So meh on the brownie, but legendary. The thing dunk. that I called the the thing that I called the Sasquatch. Yeah. They're the giant bear claw. I think it's money. So legendary donut overall, good fried. Oh fuck yeah. <laughs> You're taking something already fried, and you're frying it again? How is that a bad thing? Is that really a bad thing? I don't think so. Now we're just going to do a bunch of random shit. And uh, random shit number one 
Payday bar. Because fucking why not? And uh, I'm just going to do the full Monty on this one. This is my first time using video in a while. In a long while. A while. Why are you enunciating the H? Uh, while we're waiting on Mr. Payday or Mrs., pardon me for assuming the candy bar's gender. I'm gonna go with male. I mean, it does look kind of phallic to me. And it's full of nuts, so I mean, it's nutty. Well, it is nutty, so nah, never mind. Anyway, sometimes uh, you feel like a nut. Sometimes you don't. Yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> While we wait on that, uh, I'm gonna have a little bit of a uh, tres comas. Here's mud in your eye. Uh, it's not the best. It's not the worst. It's better than Cuervo. Not as good as Don Julio. That's a wide range of, of flavors for you. Have fun figuring that out, yeah. folks. Well, this thing right to the bottom, didn't it? <laughs> if you remember last year's video, we had a fancy candy thermometer in there. Uh, it didn't make the trip. Uh, it was one of those things I thought, we're not going to use that again. We would have used it again. So now I'm having to do it manually with this fella. Or, in his defense, if we do use it again, it'll be like once, twice a year. And we could totally buy it if we needed it again. We needed it again. I didn't think about it, so fuck it. We forgot whatever. to buy one, so we're kind of having to guess to me. And we're not going to buy a fryer because we, this is, seriously, this is the first time we have fried since the last time we fried. That makes no sense. This is the first time we've fried since the last video where we fried shit. So it's been a year since we deep fried something. We do not do it very often. It's a huge fucking mess and it's not worth the time. Yes, I'm ready for you to pull it out. Wow, that looks surprisingly good. Well, we let that cool off. There you go, folks. We have another item. A payday. And now, T-Buzz. So we found some really cool different flavored Kit Kats at Wajamaya. I think we did a video on it already. Yes, but so not this one, though. And, and we didn't fry them. So we did another video where we tried these. We're doing the strawberry Kit Kats. They were delicious, unfried. Uh, now we're going to fry them. Let's see how this does. Or... Oh, that's not going to last long. <laughs> nope, that's going to melt quick. Oh, shit. Huh? And it turned pink. Huh? It turned pink. What did? The batter turned pink. Uh, that's not... That's not working. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, that's a little pink. Let's try this motherfucker. Is it melty? Oh, It's hot. Mm. Mm. I think if there was less nuts, it'd be better. Is that what he said? Because now, or what she said. Now it's like some stupid, crazy, crunchy peanut butter, which I love, but, ha! It's okay. It's okay. But it's very hot. <laughs> Woo! See, I think that'd be better with more nuts, because the nuts took on this awesome boiled peanut texture, hmm. which I thought was kind of cool. But it still kind of gets that um, cooked peanut butter, not quite caramelly thing going on. It smells amazing, though. I was about to ask, did it make it better? Um, yeah, it's good. It intensified the strawberry flavor. Ooh. 
you kind of lose the tangy flavor from it. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, that's fucking good. That's delicious. Yeah. And now I'm kind of excited after your reaction to this. Ooh, it smells so good. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? Oh my god! That is happiness! Oh, wow! Oh, that was so good! That was a happy explosion of strawberry flavor in my mouth. I, it, fucking amazing. Wow! I tr I've tried that plain, and it was mind-blowing plain. Deep fried, just, you know, it was already here. And deep fried just went, Whoa! it's like angelic. I'm going to do some meats. I've got some salami. I've got some pepperoni. And I'm going to fold these deer up. The tusk pick. Mm. Mm. I don't know why, but the oil has been behaving so much better today, this time around. I think you're right about the... I was trying to tell you to use the other pot, and you told me no. Let's use this one, and yeah. you were right. Mark it down in history, folks. I said he was right. Mm -hmm. He said he thought that this one would hold the temperature better, and so far he has been correct. Yeah, nothing like a good old enameled cast iron pot. Flip over. This is the first time a shrieking ball bag has come running across this stage. There we go. Oh, Somebody, see? Somebody's, How relaxing is that? Somebody's hitting the bong hard. Travis loves <laughs> his cured meats, by the way. Pepperoni and salami. Mm. It's a pretty good reaction. Mm. It's hot, it's crunchy, salty, breezy, salty. Everything my doctor recommends. All right, so we'll start with cured meats like the T-Buzz. Let's keep it consistent, right? Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I haven't had that one happen before. <laughs> Deep fried some cured meats. <laughs> that is, uh, that is the shit. We got some brie. I'm gonna deep fry some brie. That's right. Go. That's thing right to the bottom. Right. Got it. Oop. Oop. There are certain things that are legal here that aren't legal in other places, um, so I hear. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, let's check out our brie. It's a uh, pop, 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 popping. It's better to have loved and lost than not to have loved at all. Come cheer up, my lads. Come cheer up, my lads. There we go. Jesus. Hi, mm. Mr. Meeseeks. Look at me. Oh, that's oily. That's oily. Oh, I'll have yeah. to try that again. Yeah, that's that's a bummer of, of oily. Oh. <laughs> 
make it. Yeah, I think that... Uh, Maybe it went too long. Uh, no. I mean, there's still some in there. There's cheese in there, but it's just oily as fuck. Although... Hopefully I got a good amount of brie in there. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> I'm still getting oil. Yeah. Maybe the brie was too cold? I don't know. Because, uh, not to say we've seen other people do it, but we've seen other people do it and it looked like mozzarella. Mm. I'd say palate cleanser, but no, I'm just keeping my buzz going. Well, thank you for joining us on this year's deep fried madness. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. Happy New Year, everybody. If you found this entertaining, please like, share, subscribe. Let us know what you want to see. Give us a few ideas. Thanks for being around. Thanks for watching the chaos that was 2019 for us. We only went through three moves. It's been a little batty. See you in 2020. Have a good year.